Hi, and welcome to this week's episode of Inside KISD Student Produce News. I'm Captain Bodovino. And I'm Jakai Wright. Thanks for joining us. On this week's episode, we'll check in on a student spotlight of one of our AB students and DECA's recent thrifting project. We'll also look into Lady Grey Wolves for softball and hit the hallways to see who will win the fight, Jake Paul or Mike Tyson. After the Shoemaker High School Lady Grey Wolves finished second in district, they will move on to play against College Station in the best of three 5A by district series. Shoemaker's head coach Steve Maddox states, We've never had a softball playoff game here, so it's fantastic. The Lady Grey Wolves began the softball season with 5-0 and have continued their winning streak through six or more games. This has been their fourth playoffs experience since they opened back in 2000. From AV to radio, Hamida Bachway has many achievements on her belt. Co-host Catherine Baldovino showcases Bachway's talents in the student spotlight. Hi, I'm Amita Bachway. I'm a student video journalist at the KISD Career Center. I um, go out around the district. I collect news stories. I help direct and run cameras and set up studio and everything. So we have our new show called Inside KISD. I direct that sometimes and then our other shows that we do. We do live things like the Christmas parade, and courting ceremony and the luncheon at the beginning of the year, I direct those. I begin my morning coming to the Career Center. I start off going to my AV production class. I usually do a lot of editing, filming, or planning for things that are coming up. And then I also go to radio. And we have our show called The Daily. I edit that a lot and we record there. And then at the end of the day, I go to Shoemaker, where I am a part of the Shoemaker Varsity Choir. So my motivation is my future. If I keep doing everything I'm doing and gaining the experience and doing all these opportunities, it'll make it easier and give me better chances to get jobs. Advice I'd give to other students that want to do what I do, stay motivated and stay on it. Like, to be in this class, you really have to want to do things. Like, don't get lazy. Try to like seize everything in front of you because we get a lot of opportunities in this class and you should take every opportunity. Last week, the youth breaking cycle from Colleen Elementary School took it upon themselves to collect donations for firefighters. Items such as food and supplies were provided for workers, giving them extra boost for when they needed to stay late on the job. The school's site director, Cinnamon Clay, says that YBC meets weekly and that they focus on skills such as self-esteem, accountability, and education. Recently, thrifting has been on the rise for its environmental benefits. To help promote thrifting, KCC DECA students went out to dress up two special guests, Dr. Cunningham and Superintendent Dr. Fay. Student journalist Aiden Shepard gives us a look into the project. Hi, my name is Ella Brzezowski. Hello, my name is Hina Swanky. We are the creators of Thrifting My Way. Thrifting My Way is a social media-based reference tool for the public, offering educating individuals about topics such as overproduction, the reduction of waste, and the benefits of thrifting. We do this by creating content in partnership with Plato's Closet for platforms such as Instagram and TikTok. Thrifting My Way is set on the foundation of negating the causes from fast fashion and all the environmental impacts and the labor practices that are caused from the mass production of these trends. Okay, okay. so how was your experience thrifting with us today? I enjoyed my experience thrifting with y'all. I was pleasantly surprised by the items that you found that were able to fit me and it was definitely mm -hmm. stuff that like I would not have tried before by myself mm -hmm. and so I enjoyed it. It was fun. Yay! And now what are your like thoughts and opinions on thrifting now that you have more information on it and you've tried it yourself. Mm -hmm. I think one of the things that I like best about it is the sustainability mm -hmm. um, as far as the economic impact that y'all mentioned and even the environmental impact of fast fashion. Uh -huh. um, I definitely believe in sustainability and, and using things that we already have and making, I like the idea of seeing 
something beautiful and something that's traditionally overlooked. Yes. I like that idea. That was I love good. that. Yep. Well, thank you so much for coming and shopping with us. We appreciate you, you so me. much. It was fun. Yes. My first question for you is, what are your thoughts on thrifting after having this experience? Well, I actually really enjoyed it uh, because number one, I didn't have to select the clothes myself, uh, which I have a hard time with because I'm not good at determining what goes good with other things. Uh, and I also enjoyed uh, being with the people that were here. Uh, but ultimately, I like it that uh, the, the project that you're working on uh, has a sustainability factor to it, so I really like that. And what would you say is like the best part of this experience? Being with you. Thank you. Yeah, being with students and seeing students thrive and be passionate about stuff. Like that's really important to education and I think I know that. So, Thank now, you for your time. on the thrifting side, I will tell you, it's super nice to go into a store and find clothes that fit you that cost a lot less money. There you go. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yes, Appreciate thank you. it. As boxing grows more popular, one fight stands at high discourse. Co-host Ja'Kai Wright hits the halls to find out who will win, Jake Paul or Mike Tyson. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be filming who's going to be winning the big fight, Jake Paul or Mike Tyson. Hey, don't go nowhere. Don't leave. Hey, who do you think's winning the fight, Mike Tyson or Jake Paul? <laughs> Mike Tyson. <laughs> hey, who do you think's winning the fight, Mike Tyson or Jake Paul? Um, Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson. Um, he's just a goat. The goat. Here he is. Actually, I don't know much about boxing, but Jake Paul, cause he's younger. I know how good Mike Tyson used to be and everything, but low key Jake Paul. Because Mike Tyson's a little old now, so. Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson. Did you see him warming up? Like, is that so? Mike? Yeah, we got Mike. Um. Mike Tyson? Yeah. Uh, I got Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson? Yeah. Alright, thank you. Uh, Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson? Yeah. Mike Tyson. Thank you for watching Inside KISD Student Produced Television. For Catherine Baldovino, our crew backstage, and all of us here at the Career Center, I'm Dakar Wright, and we'll see you next time on Inside KISD.